I was born two months premature, diagnosed with spastic diaplegia. Told I wouldn't walk or talk, I never really knew what I was going to do. And if you said it would be a, a race car, I would have uh, laughed in your face and pushed you out the door. When Nicholas Hamilton gets in a car, his disability is not a factor. He races against the able-bodied on equal terms. I'm already doing it. This year I'm in the British Touring Car Championship. It's the pinnacle of British motorsport. Uh, I'm the only uh, disabled athlete, you know, doing it and racing um, at that level. His brother Lewis might be the Formula One champion, but in the racing world, Nicholas's achievement is just as inspiring. You know, for me, when I started uh, racing in 2011, I was the only, you know, disabled you know, driver doing it at a top level. And my whole point was uh, to race for myself, but realise that I was inspiring all these people, able-bodied or disabled, um, to, to, to race or be a part of motorsport. Now he's leading the way for other drivers, helping launch the world's first racing academy for people with disabilities. Why do you like driving so much? This is the first sport where you're not classed as disabled. So like when I'm here, I feel like I'm like everybody else. And knowing that this is a way of kind of showcasing to everybody else as well, that no, we're not, yeah, we might be disabled people, but we're still able to be on the field of everybody else. Team Brit is a, a racing team made up solely of disabled racing drivers. Our aim is to compete on a total level playing field in mainstream, in mainstream racing. If we want to inspire other disabled people to get into racing, we get so many inquiries, so we said, right, let's set up a race academy. It doesn't exist anywhere in the world. It's another, another British first, and we're really proud of that. Nick, I, really I trust you it, completely. And the thrill of driving at 120 miles an hour is unique. I think with, with motorsport, surprisingly, you know, disabled people are treated as equals, um, and, um, and that's a really good boost because anybody that wants to get into the sport, um, you know, will be welcome. This is a sport which is no longer about disability. It's now just about ability. Rags Martel, ITV News, Dunsfold Park Racetrack in Surrey.